Uh, what's this I hear? Your mama said that you want a DNA test. Oh, wow. You in the car? No. Why do you want a DNA test for my child? So you ain't gonna get in the car? What happened? Like, you said all this time that you did not need no DNA test. We've been in a relationship for five years, and all of a sudden, I don't know what's going on, but all of a sudden now you want a DNA test. Okay, since you ain't gonna get in the car and talk to me, I'm gonna be real with you. I don't think... I just don't know. The baby is like so light. You don't know what? What do you the baby is four fucking days old? Like what do you mean? Like so you really want a DNA test for our baby? I didn't come out the womb like that and it don't matter. So 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 tell me this. Like, do you think that I was cheating at all? Our whole relationship. We've been together five years. You always know where I'm at. I'm always at the house. If I do leave out the house, I'm with you. You honestly think I was cheating? I don't think you was cheating, but what's wrong with me getting a DNA test? Why I do you need a DNA test? I just want to know for a fact. You do know for a fact. I don't know for a fact. You don't know for a fact that this your child. That's what the DNA test for. No, I don't. You know. don't know for no, a fact. I don't know. What's but we've been DNA together test? for five years. My mama said she did DNA test just to be sure. Because mama know your best. Your mama wasn't in our relationship though. That's. I feel like that's so disrespectful that you even want a DNA test for our child. We've been together for five years. Do you have anything to worry about? You're literally talking about us have getting you, married you next year. Me? Have you cheated on me? No, I have not. So what you no, worried I have about not. the fuck? I'm I not worried. You don't gotta pay for it. I'm I gotta not worried it. about it. I just find it just so odd. All of a sudden, now you're in a DNA test, and all of a sudden, you just questioning the baby. Listen. I just Are wanna, you questioning our son? I just want to know for sure. That's it. So you questioning whether he's yours or not? I just want to know for sure. That's it. So you don't know for sure? I don't And we've been together for five years. No, I don't know. So can you start making this? So you don't know? All right. That's how you feel. <laughs> Baby, it this week, cause it might calm you down. I rub your feet listening to everything you oh. talking about. Let a man ask me for a DNA test for a child that he knows is his because you only been met. What's wrong with a man asking for a DNA test? Come on now. He didn't carry that baby. He doesn't know what you did on days when he wasn't around. He just won't prove that the kid is his. By right, I think every man should be given a DNA test mm. upon when a child is born so he doesn't spend the rest of his life raising a kid that doesn't belong to him. Preach. And why are we acting like there aren't women out here pinning kids on men that it doesn't belong to? Mm. My thing is, you went as far as saying it's embarrassing or he's trying to embarrass you when he asks for a DNA test. It's only embarrassing when you're sleeping around and you know for a fact the baby not his. My thing is, why y'all so offended when they ask for a DNA test? If you know the baby's his, I don't think there is no offense behind it. Of course, he just won't prove the baby's his. What is wrong with that? I feel like women that get offended by men asking for DNA tests are women that sleep around with a lot of men and don't know who the father is, and they just tend to pin the baby on whoever. Bruh, he ain't my fucking kid. None of that shit, bruh. Bruh, he ain't my kid, bruh. Can you prove that he's my kid? Go get a DNA test done. You go get a DNA test done, come back and holler. I got a whole DNA test right here. It's not my fucking child. Damn. Ain't no probability of it my kid. That's tough. Look, look. Look, it's so about nigga at the child support office. That's the child support office. I'm so crazy, nigga. That's the child support office, nigga. He ain't even my goddamn kid. Whatever the fuck it is, you go get He's not my fucking kid. Probability of paternity. He's not even my kid. Look, he's not man. Look, look, he's not man. He's not man, bro. You can live your life now, bro. He's not man. What the fuck would you call me a damn kid for that's not man? He's not even man. Take that shit, man. <laughs> Ain't even fucking mad. Well, you got a basket on top. Okay, oh, that's his shit. Give him his shit. Give him his shit. You saw I knew with my son. I bought him all of this little shit. He can have the rest of it too. This is all his shit. I bought all of it. I bought all of it except for that little blue pants, some old ass pants she brought, and then right there. Paul, you ain't bought me shit. Paul, don't like you or your kid. What the fuck? Go find a message. Paul, you ain't bought a shit. I done bought everything for the... Paul, you ain't even seen this. This ain't even part. It wouldn't make no difference. He ain't my goddamn kid. The blood test says. Huh. The blood test says, not mine. Damn. We get it. We get it. You don't even know who your goddamn baby daddy is. You are not... <laughs> Sensational. Sensational.